what up boys and welcome back to another video so as always every single monday we take a look at my transmog sales on my transmog only tune and we see how much gold we've made and this is actually going to be uh well almost the last one we got like one more opening on monday on the 23rd but that's like the day well midnight to the 24th is when we have the uh the expansion, Shadowlands expansion. So we're gonna have a uh, one clean out, one more clean out after this one, uh, and then the uh, next clean outs are not gonna be transmog. They're gonna be uh, well from Shadowlands content farms. As I can't be ours to deal with my transmog tune, uh, whatever Shadowlands is out. Like that's the reason why I post for forty eight hours on my transmog tune because I don't want to spend. Uh, any time on it it's super boring to spend time with the auction house so when shadowlands comes out i don't think i'm gonna i might do like i did like when bfa came out just forget about my transmog tune for like a couple of weeks and just lay it uh let all the uh the stuff expire in the mailbox and just focus on the new content uh but we'll see most likely anyways this week uh we actually uh yeah look at this 596 sold auctions that is actually the highest amount of sold auctions that i've had in one week that's like a new record man in uh bfa in bfa only sure i did have that week when i made like 8 million gold but that i don't think that counts so besides from that we've had a bunch of cleanouts at like 500 but uh never 596 that's like a, a new record in like auctions sold doesn't mean that it's gonna be uh a lot of gold out of it though but we'll see the first 100 auctions eighty-seven thousand gold like a rage deal uh, breastplate on the first one and i'm selling a lot of ceremonial nightbane carapace like the uh most of these super expensive stuff ceremonial again but like this has a market value of like tw over 20k i used to sell them for like forty thousand gold easily in the past but it seems like the majority of, uh, well, a lot of these sales, actually, I can take a look at this Aboriginal Black Knight. Like, a lot of it is, like, just low-value farm to transmog. It's insane. Uh, my auction house currently has, like, 2,900 items, would, which would be worth, like, almost 30 million golds, right? In uh, early BFA, a late Legion, but now it's so bad, it's, like, half that. Okay, let's see. Next clean out. Better. 102,000 gold. Let's see if there's anything worth mentioning. Replica Light Forge has a bad price though. 9.5k. Ornate Mithril Boots. 19,000 gold for those bad boys. 25k. That's another Night Pain Carapace. 26, really. Was that it? That was it. Nothing else uh, cool to mention, at least, on that one. And we should have, like, 400 auctions left. But we're going to need to see uh, some bigger sales if this is going to be a good clean out. Nothing to brag about. Hopefully. Everything is so low. Like, there's very few things that I can actually sell for a lot of gold now. I don't think I have a lot of, ex like, really expensive transmog. And that was it, right? Yeah. 109,000 gold on this one. Windwalker foot wraps from the Arakua Feather Handen bag at 12k. Uh, selling some uh, Vanguard legs, really bad price. Somebody definitely reset the Watcher's robe, buying out all of them. Sulfur and Hammer, 31,000 gold. Absolutely horrible. Somebody buying out some Jade breastplates, which I'm fine with. I have a million of them. Uh, barbaric loincloth, nothing cool. Just a lot of minor sales. Titan steel helmet crafted. Nah. And 109,000 gold from that one too. So. We're most likely. Going to reach half a million gold. That's always the weekly uh, goal. But it depends. We might have uh, the last 200 auctions. Might suck. Uh, look at that. Ceremonial leather harness. 106 gold. Mm. Oh shit! The Black Rock sold. But won't you look at that? Nice. 
All right, then. No, so that means the uh, next 100 auctions is 374,000 gold. Oh, that is so beautiful. I remember uh, even when I made a video on it, it uh, wasn't too long ago. It was after pre-patch where I mentioned that you could get the Blackrock Bulwark. Or no, it was my 10 hours of Wad farms where I just did like three different farms in Wad for like uh, epic drops and blue drops. And I mentioned that I got the shield and somebody said it would never sell. And uh, you know how it is, right? And now it sells again. This time for slightly less though. Only up on the auctions for 291k. But I'm actually super surprised that it even sold for that. Because we've had the uh, Halloween event. Which has uh, been like another source to get the Blackrock Bulwark. And then we've had like a thousand different farms that people have been doing for raw gold. Which has also been dropping epics. So these all wad items in general has gone down in price. This one has also been like cut in half right now. It was almost 600,000 gold when I first posted it. But uh, I mean, I'll take it. Definitely. Titanium spike arts 11k. Ice guard breastplate 23k. Vanguard salt stone. Okay. But that means we're at, what, like 675,000 gold or something like that? Yeah, uh, that's good. Okay. Now we're talking. And we still got like, what, 200 uh, auctions left? Ish. Oh, but the next ones are not really good. 84,000 gold in the next 100. Another Sulfur and Hammer. Same price, roughly 31k. 11k. Okay. Oh, Star goes Walking Stick. I think that's a Wad Blue item again. But that sucked ass. But that leaves us at over a 700,000 gold, though. Yeah. And then there's at least another 100 in the mailbox, as we can see. Well, hopefully. Come on. Reset. Be above 100. Okay. Yeah, we're now at 759. Mailbox hasn't reset just yet. There we go. 101,000 gold in the last 97 auctions. Windwalker boots again from the Araqua Feather hand in. Then we'll get some pure steel leg plates, 27k. Is there anything else worth mentioning? Ooh, glorious legs selling at 18k. It's so bad. But regardless, though, dude, this was a really good clean out. Sure, we got a bit saved with that Blackrock Bulwark. But, like, even without the Blackrock Bulwark, man, we would have made a lot of gold. We still would have made, uh, like, 600,000 gold, right? Yeah, roughly. Almost 600,000 gold without it. But, hey, it did sell, so it definitely counts. Uh, 861,000 gold in this week's total. And, um, don't forget to, uh, also... Pick up the 0 to 10 million gold guide. You guys can use the uh, the code Shadowlands for 50% off. I mean, you guys are going to be swimming in billions. Some people are even making trillions. So uh, there's always that. Shadowlands is coming soon. And uh, the link is going to be down below in the comment section and the description. So make sure you use the code Shadowlands so you can actually get a 50% off. That's $9.99 with the code used. Anyways... Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in tomorrow's video. Until then, bye-bye.